Hello, disheveled ones, and welcome to another disheveled opening video. Look what I got. I got a Scream Factory box. Well, technically Shout Factory, but we all know it's Scream Factory in there. We know that's what I got. Yeah, so I took a part of this sale that they had going last week. Uh, their little Shocktober thing. I think that's what it's called. I don't remember exactly. But, um, and then I also have a, um, package from Amazon. Uh, I'm afraid that the Scream Factory is going to be, going to disappoint me just a bit because I am a slipcover guy and uh, I got three collector editions in here and they're kind of oldish, so I'm probably not going to have a slipcover, so it's probably going to break my heart, but let's find out. All right. Oh, way to hit the camera. wrapping sorry about that guys just realized my damn tripod uh uh crank was like in the shot and i'm like what am i doing still pretty newbie at this thing so i hope you guys can forgive all right so what did i get Saturday, the 14th. It's like reaching in the goodie bag. Howling 3. I've never watched either of these movies. I, I know Howling 3 is not that good. Um, but that's okay. I sometimes enjoy the not that good movies. Well, look at there, yo, look at this, y'all. So this was one of the ones I was worried that would not have a slip. Uh, Sleepwalkers, I mean, it's relatively, um, it's relatively old, right? But it had a slip, so. Sorry about the shaky camera. I like I said, uh, I gotta figure out a good way to do these openings. So maybe I should just stay uh, on camera. Hell, I don't know. Also, I upgraded the craft. That's a movie uh, we love around this house. Um, I had the uh, blue I got from Target like a couple years ago. Uh, it was on, it was on sale, and uh, went on and did the. Uh, the Scream Factory upgrade, and I won't look back. I'll just get rid of that one, unless there's a features on it that's not on my uh, that's not on that, which I kind of doubt. And then my first um, Hammer um, Blu-ray have a lot of the hammer on DVD and these collections and stuff, but this was my first Blu-ray hammer. Um, and I've never actually seen this movie, so I'm excited about that. That was a cute little wrapping they had going on there, wasn't it? All right, let's see what's in here. I think I know what's in here. I think it's all, besides uh, a, uh, a DVD box set that I'm grabbing that's not horror related that I just bought yesterday. I'm pretty sure I know what this is going to be. Oh, yes. The Amityville, Amityville Horror Trilogy. 
I heard that this one is going out of print out uh um Scream Factory. So I just had to go ahead and jump on that. Um I've not seen I've not seen any of them but like the original Amityville. Um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to, uh, diving into the, the possession. Um, I'm going to have to do a Amityville watch marathon so, soon. All right, guys. That's what I got. All of it is some shout scream goodness. I am so tickled that all of my collector's editions had the slip cover that makes me happy all right uh i'll have another opening video coming up probably in, probably next week um i'll be opening a couple of packages uh two or three um just let me know what i could do better what view you want i know this shaky cam crap has to go um but hey please leave me a comment let me know um have you seen any of these movies um are they good i've seen this one it's ugh, it's okay uh that one i love not seeing this one I and mean, i already talked about that actually i think i already told you about this um so i am out don't forget, always stay spooky.